Hi guys, this is Basker Berry and in this video I'm going to show you how to use the data conversion transformations. So what is this data conversion transformation? The transformations which applies the data conversion functions to change the data type, column length or precision and scale to the input data column and adds column with the new data to the output row. This is the actual definition given by the MSDN. But the very important part here is uh, it changes the data type from one format to other format. Usually this transformation comes to useful when we are loading the data from the Excel or the CSV files to the OLEDB destinations files. And yeah, the precision and scale is very important in the real time where we are using the dealing with the financial uh, amount. Uh, the Even the um, 0 0.001 dollar is also very important uh, in these scenarios where we the financial records where we the checks for the accuracy so be careful with this type of uh, scaling and all okay let me show you the actual demo of this go to the solution i'm going to create a new package and rename it to the data conversion demo Okay, add the Excel connections. I'm going to load it from the Excel sheet to the table, table DC. Okay, and let me show you the actual source here. If you see at the table DC in the file, uh, we have the format as uh, as a text but the it is an input uh, as id integer so we need to load convert this text into the integer okay i'm going to create a uh, be for the destinations okay drag and drop the dft task here and rename it to data conversion Okay, drag and drop the OLEDB source, sorry, Excel source, and it's present in sheet one columns. Okay, and after this, drag and drop the data conversion transformation. So, here we can see this the ID, and the usually the naming convention is also very important for the any transformations. The, the naming conventions would be like. Uh, respect to the that so uh, here i am going to use the um, dc for data conversion so convert into integer type and sign integer so if you see here there are so many types that in, in data conversion so i am going to use uh, integer type here click ok and uh, go to the target uh, that's a oledb load it into the oledb destination It will be the Excel source. Here we got the table. Table DC is the one, and the mapping is automatically mapped because of the name. But we are going to use the DC where we will convert that. And if you see here, uh, this still is a warning saying that uh, truncation may occur in the inserting data flow in the column name. Okay, there is a name which has a conversion pro not conversion problem. There is a data length problem, so we can even solve the uh, giving the length of that. So it's a 50 in the actual destination, so we can give it here 50 and um, change the mapping to the respective one go to here and give the dc name here you can see this uh, the warning has gone now so let me save it and run it for you um, so the data conversions as uh, run successfully and 11 row codes has been inserted let us check in the back end so you can see this uh, it's now the integer type it has been loaded into the integer type okay and uh, one more thing to show you is like the other skill precision scale and these things where this comes to the deal when we are dealing with the amount type okay thank you for watching please do subscribe my youtube channel